Hello, I want to do a quick review um, on this Air Things radon detector. Um, it's things pretty straightforward. It works. Um, I would give it an A+. Uh, there's just a few things you need to know about it. So you have your long-term reading. This is the reading over the lifetime it's been uh, wherever it's uh, detecting uh, radon. So this is a long-term. Then it's got a short-term, so one day. So in the last day, that was the 0.35. Then it has a seven-day, more of a short, uh, longer term. Average over the last week has been 0.45. So then it'll cycle between those two readings just to give you the readings. So it gives you three readings, which is pretty cool. All right. Um, on the back side, it's got it's got the where it takes the air in. So you're going to put this somewhere in like a central location where it can get a lot of air, and you know, more air the better because it's you know it'll detect uh, be able to detect the best reading for you. It has a reset button. It has a place to hang it, which is nice. It also has a mode button. Okay, so the mode button is pretty straightforward. We're gonna hit the mode button one time. It's gonna come back, it's gonna tell us how many days has a long-term, is a long-term uh, reading for. So 74 days. So over 74 day period, my uh, average radon is 0.4, which is great. If I hit it again, it's gonna give me a code. This code can be sent to air things and they will send you an official report if you need it for any kind of uh, official reporting if you're selling your house or something like that. Um, I will say I did have this thing, um, uh, you know, I had a professional uh, radon detection uh, company come out and do a reading. This thing had the same exact uh, reading. So it does work. Um, I've lent it out to people and they have used it in their basements and have detected that there's radon there. Um, so I would recommend this uh, if you want it. There's a link down below. Um, thanks.